Hi guys, welcome. Today I will show you the multi barcode scanning functionality for the enterprise edition. So as you can see, we have three different products here. And if I open any of the product for the test, this is a default barcode field and we have given a additional one tab and here you can add n number of barcodes here for your purposes. So uh, the idea behind uh, to give a multi barcode is like uh, there can be a many purposes for what you are using those barcodes. So we can add multi, multi barcode here and as you can see uh, I have uh, one scenario like say uh, we have this barcode for this vendor, this barcode for this vendor and this one for this vendor. Okay, and this is uh, the default one. So uh, we have total four barcodes for storage box, and the same we can print it uh, from the print labels. By default, it is printing the default barcode, but we have adapted the functionality so that it will also add the custom barcodes as well. So if you want to print it uh, the label, then you can see uh, the label will print like this. Okay, this is a default one. Uh, uh, 001, 002, 3 and 4 that is what we have added here as you can see 2, 3 and 4 this is a default one so uh, as you can see hit okay and the same sheet I have printed locally to show you the operations uh, for with that uh, barcode different barcodes okay and the same thing uh, I have printed for uh, storage box and large desk and also for the pedal bin as you can see i have added the additional barcodes multi barcodes uh, for all these three products okay now uh, let's uh, try to receive one uh, order receipt for this uh, these three products so let's go to the operations tab okay now go to the receipts here this uh, I have one order for 20 quantity each for all these three products so I will scan first for the uh, paddle bin or let's say a uh, large desk the first line as you can see here as you can see for the large desk I have four different barcodes so I can scan any of the barcode and uh, it will add the quantity for uh, it will add the quantity so let me show you let's suppose I scanning the this one one then another one then uh, third one and fourth one okay so I have scanned four different barcodes and now I am going to scan another let's say fifth Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, four, four, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eight, eighteen, ninety. Okay, and the twenty. So as you can see, I have scanned uh, five times each of the barcode. Now same thing I will do for the storage box as well. As you can see, I have a print sheet for the storage box and it has four different barcodes okay and I will scan four of them one by one or I can scan uh, five times all the four one two three four five okay now I will scan another barcode one two three four five I will scan another one two three four five one two two three four five five okay so storage box is scanned now we have the remaining uh, product is paddle bin as you can see here and I have a paddle bin uh, print sheet as well for the barcode so I will scan one by one one two three four five or I will scan another barcode one two three four five one two Three, four, five, one, two, two, three, four, five. Okay. As you can see, <coughs> now uh, 
all the quantities are added so i will do validate and the transfer is done already okay so if i refresh it this page this is done already okay this is done already the same way uh, we can uh, do the delivery order and internal transfer as well now let's uh, do the inventory adjustments and let's see if uh, we can okay let's say pedal bin and if i add a new one as a storage box let me scan the barcode for the storage box okay i'll scan another barcode for storage box another barcode for storage box and the fourth barcode for storage box okay now i will scan the four different barcodes for the large desk let's say one two three and four so i have scanned four different bus uh, barcodes for large desk and now i will scan for the pedal bin one two three okay so as you can see uh, it is uh, also working in the inventory adjustment okay now i can apply it and you can see the invent uh, this inventory adjustment is done so we can go to the operations inventory adjustments and as you can see large cabinet storage box uh, are being just a minute where it is pedal bin storage box this is a storage box what we have uh, calculated it this is a large desk and pedal bin so all three are here it's already uh, uploaded as you can see here you see all are done so this is how we can uh, use this multi barcode feature uh, for the inventory operations and inventory adjustments hope you will find this useful uh, for your purpose if you want uh, any information on top of this or if you need any uh, help then you can let us know and uh, we will surely help you out thanks for watching